Hello and welcome to Dean Pigeon Gaming. Today I am playing Minecraft Story Mode by Telltale Games. So, I saw the trailer for this and to be honest it looked a bit shit. However, I have played most of the Telltale Games series and I have to say, every single time they blow me away it's absolutely brilliant. I'm really hoping this isn't the game that's going to let me down but I'm hoping it'll be good. I have faith that it'll be good. So um, let's start a new game. What do I look like? Who am I? So apparently play as someone called Jesse. As either a, a guy or a girl. Well, I have long dark hair and palish skin, so and green eyes, so that's perfect. That'll be me. Um I don't have a red well I don't I do have a red t shirt, but I don't have dungarees. So uh, I guess, I guess that'll do. That'll do. That'll that'll be my character. So a Telltale Minecraft game. It's, so <laughs> episode one, the Order of the Stone. Okay, let's let's get right into this. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Nothing built can last forever, and every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. With each passing year, more and more details are lost, until all that remains are myths, half-truths. To put it simply, lies. And yet, in all the known universe, between here and the Far Lands, the legend of the Order of the Stone endures, unabridged as self-evident fact. Indeed, it is only a troubled land that has need for heroes, and ours was fortunate to have, so long ago, four heroes such as these. Gabriel, the warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble. Eligard, the redstone engineer, whose machines would spark an era of invention. Magnus the Rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. And Soren, the architect, builder of worlds, and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. Okay. But when one story ends, another one begins. Would you rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Just to be clear, um, you wouldn't have any weapons or armor, so you'd have to fight them with your hands. That's easy. I'll take the little tiny little zombies. A hundred of them. Crawling all over you with their tiny hands. Uh, all set them I need fire. is like a shovel. Uh, I'm telling you, way too easy. So I've got a daylight sensor on the roof, mm -hmm. and if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Reuben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us. Really? <laughs> what kind of question is that? Of course he is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird that you take him with you everywhere you go? He kind of makes us look like, I don't know, amateurs. He's my wingman. People <laughs> always want to talk to the girl with the pig. They do. You mean talk about the girl with the pig? Like, look Reuben? at the weird girl with the weird pig? How weird. I, like I didn't being mean weird. anything by it. I'm Screw glad you. he's coming. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. I'm getting tired of it. Just embrace it. Embrace being a loser, Olivia. And if you do that, you can be whatever you want to be. What if I want to be a winner? Except that. <laughs> Anything else, though? 
<laughs> All right. Fun. Do you hear that? Oh, no. Uh, is that crazy? Oh, really? <laughs> You guys totally freaked out. That was, uh, uh. Axel, what's the matter with you? Great. Now I'm gonna smell like a pig and Cool mask. Time. Cool mask. Yeah. It Pretty is, cool mask. isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Very convincing. <laughs> the look on your faces. Did you bring the fireworks? Of course I did. I even brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Ruben a disguise? Yes, oh, and the dragon costume. We're going costume. to a convention. Somebody's got to wear a costume. Oh my god, yes. That's amazing. It looks awesome. Awesome. It only took me like pig. a million hours to build it. All right, all right. You definitely brought the fireworks, right? Yes, I'm ready. Waiting on you guys. See, now he's your wingman. Stop. Oh, yeah. My wing dragon. Hurry up and grab your stuff. We'll meet you downstairs, okay? Okay. Okay, ah, I can move now. Let's see what's in this chest. Shears. Definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. Okay. Let's look at the Gabriel banner. Gabriel the warrior. You think we'll ever get that famous? Maybe? It's not impossible. Maybe I'll get famous for my sweet poster collection. I have a few posters. <laughs> oh, my hair is just gone. Let's look at this One banner. of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition. Damn and right when we, will. we do, people will look at us and say, Hey, there goes Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition. Yeah. Hang on. So she's got um, a clip in her. I happen to have a clip. It's not yellow. Wait, what? Which side should this be on here? Wait, hang on. Yeah, this side. I have a spooky ghost clip. Yeah. Okay, let's do this. Let's look at the armor stand. I got the stand as a gift. But I don't have any armor to put on it. Maybe someday. Let's look at Reuben. Give Talk me a dragon war, Reuben. <laughs> That'll do, Reuben. That'll do. That was demonic. <laughs> okay, what else can I look at? Is there anything else I can look at in this room? What's in this chest? Uh, flint and steel, not too shabby. Uh. Anything else? Or do I have to go? Okay, I will use this trapdoor. Well, come on, Ruben, you ender pig. Let's go. That's everything. Let's roll. Yeah, dude. Roll. Let's go. I heard a pretty juicy rumor about the building competition, but you guys have to promise not to say anything. Okay. Also, it's in two parts. Each part more exciting than the last. Spit it out, Axel. Part one, the special guest at this year's Enercon is none other than Gabriel the warrior him freaking self. Whoa! What's part two? Part two, according to my sources, the winner of the building competition's gonna get to meet him. It doesn't mean anything if we lose. But if we win, oh man, this would make up for all the losing. It's not that big of a deal. Yeah. Endercon will be fun either way. What? Uh, hold on. Let me try that again. What? He's right, Jesse. This is people. Incredibly. This is a huge deal. So, does this source of yours make posters for a living? Huh? <laughs> yeah, my uh, source uh, doesn't exist. You guys are my only friends. Aww. Guys, let's stay focused. We have a competition to win. We never win. And this year we've got Reuben with us. We basically have no chance. <laughs> Anything, Anything can, happen. can happen, Olivia. Then why have we lost nine of these in a row? You can't. No, you can't look at this as a whole. The odds are refreshed each time. Maybe no one else will show up? Now you're being realistic. 
Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. You have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay, then. So how do we do this? We don't just build something functional. We build something fun! Like a giant After penis! After we the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. We might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't uh, Enderman be better? Also been done. I'm more scared of Endermen than creepers. They both have their moments. Both pretty scary. <laughs> then again, you scared the crap out of us with a zombie. creeper today. <laughs> Let's build a zombie. I guess that's kind of like a creeper. Eh, it's a monster. It's fine. We are so ready. Yeah. We're building a zombie. I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Think we've got everything we need? I think they'll do that in the to grab best. a little more. Let's get to grabbing then. We're so prepared. We can't lose. Cannot. Bring it in. <laughs> Dare to prepare on three. Nope. Preparing is daring. Nope. That's the same thing. Forget it. Team on three. One, two, three. Team. 